This is Randy Thompson coming to you live with Susan Faulkner Evans, and uh, she's riding Bo. Bo is now competing seriously in second level, so we're working on our canter work now, and we need him to rock back more and sit on his haunches. So you can see she's working on, that's it. Supple him more when he comes down to the walk, because it's gonna be when he breaks gait, you're gonna take him down to a collected walk. Good, and praise him a lot. Make sure he's supple. Good. It's all right, yeah? Now when he came down, you gave just a little bit too much rain. You felt that, right? So he should come down from shortening his body instead of stretching his neck longer. It's okay to do a mini stretch, but now we want him to shorten his body, which is a lot different than training in first level. Take your time, it's all about thought. That's right, collected walk into the canter depart. Good, take your time, supple him a lot more. Good, good, that's all right, he's trying to figure it out. That's all right, that's all right. Yep, he's gonna make a lot of mistakes. I think this is the fourth time we've worked on this type of canter with Bo, where he's doing a collected canter on the aids. So this is totally new for him, and this is what you're gonna have happen to your horse when you try this. It sounds like it should be so easy, but it's not. Good, take your time, take your time. That's right, supple him. That's right, take your time, take your time. This is a new balance for him. Good, good, take your time. He's not quite sure what she wants yet. He's never cantered this slow. Good, good, that's it, good. I like how you kept him up there. That's it. Now if it's easier for him, start on the serpentines. And when he breaks gate, just start a serpentine in, in whatever direction or whatever, or keep changing directions. very pleased with his progress. It's taken us several years to get him to where he became willing in his riding. He had a lot of behavioral issues. That's where he, that's it. You felt where he needed to be more supple. This is hard because you're asking him to sit down in the transition. He would rather fall apart. He says, I'd rather be a training level horse here. Take your time. This is very, very hard for him because you're really asking him to sit down when he goes up and down now. And he's, we've never asked him to do that on the canter before. That's it, remember to praise him a lot. Take your time bringing him down, slower, slower, slower. That's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. Good, good, that's all right, that's all right. Good, good, praise him. And just play with it because this is the gray area. He's got to make a lot of mistakes. Supple him more. He's gotta be looser in his back and neck. That's all right, that's right, good. Looser in his back and neck. That's it, you can do a simple change. That's it, looser in his back and neck, slower. And we're just not talking slower, but uh, shorter steps is what it really is. That's it, that's all right, that's all right. He doesn't know how to carry it yet. Good, praise him a lot. You can feel where he dives, that's where you want him to sit. So think sit, sit half halt, half halt, half halt, half halt. He's saying, I'm not sure I like this half halt here. Half halt, half halt, good, good. Yes, you can feel that one step where he drops his nose. It's nothing he's doing wrong. You've never balanced him like this for the canter walk transitions before. Good, half halt, keep him on your aids. Good, half halt, half halt, half halt, half halt. That's all right, that's all right. First time we've done this, so we don't care. He can make all the mistakes he wants right now because he's actually giving you some nice canters. Good, shorten the length of your rein. Good. He stayed uphill that time. So for second level, he has to do a collected canter into a collected walk. Oh, that's right. You wanted to work on your counter canters too. It's going to be the same thing with your counter canter. You're going to be half halting him every step, especially on his weak side. So half halt, half halt, and get him really comfortable with the, with the half halts and his counter canters. Half halt, half halt. Half halt, he needs to be a lot more supple in the front. Supple him more, so he sits down more. Sit down more, good, sit down more. Sit, 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 sit. There he goes, good. Going to a counter canter and keep him in that same balance. That's it. We're back to the regular canter, which is fine. Supple him more. Now when you're gonna go into your counter canter, keep him up with your leg. 
Oh, I know it's hard. That's it. Suppling more. More leg. Needs to have more suppling on the left rein. That's all right. This is really hard. You've never asked him to stay this collected in his, in his counter canter. He's telling you you're crazy. So you just let him tell you he's cr that you're crazy and you praise him and work him through it. Good boy. Oh yeah, it just takes time. But you can feel where you can do the half halts to get him rounder. Whew, that's a workout. All right.